Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix iMessage shows sharing name and photo not available error on iPhone. Solution 1 is make sure that you sign in with iMessage. If you didn't sign in with iMessage, you will get this error. First, make sure that you sign in to iCloud with your Apple ID and use the same Apple ID for iMessage. To sign in to iMessage, launch settings app. Next, tap on messages. Now tap on send and receive. Next, Tap on use your Apple ID for iMessage and tap sign in. Then enter your Apple ID and password. If you get verification error while doing this, then switch your network from Wi-Fi to cellular data. Solution 2 is turn off iMessage and FaceTime and turn on them again. Tap on settings icon from the home screen. Scroll down the screen and tap on messages. Now turn off iMessage and go back. Find and tap on FaceTime. Then turn off FaceTime. Next restart your iPhone and turn on FaceTime and iMessage again. Solution 3 is check the Apple ID and phone number. Make sure that your iCloud and iMessage account have the same contact information. To check that, go to settings app. Next, tap on messages. Now tap on send and receive. Make sure that you added the same phone number and email attached to your iCloud account. If it's different from iCloud Apple ID, Delete it and re-add the iCloud Apple ID for iMessage. Solution 4 is sign out of iMessage and FaceTime and sign in back. Go to settings app. Next tap on messages. Now tap on send and receive. Then tap on your Apple ID. And tap sign out from the pop-up window. Then go back. Select FaceTime. Tap on your Apple ID and select sign out. Once you're done, restart your iPhone. Now sign in back to iMessage and FaceTime using your Apple ID. Solution 5 is sign out from iCloud and sign in back. Launch settings app. Now tap on your name. Then scroll down the screen to bottom and tap on sign out. Next follow the on screen instructions to sign out. Wait for a few seconds and sign in back to iCloud. Solution 6 is Reset all settings. To do that, launch settings app. Next, tap on general. Then tap on reset at bottom. Select reset all settings. Next, enter the passcode if prompted. Again tap on reset all settings from the pop-up window to confirm this process. Solution 7 is force restart. If you are using iPhone 8 and later models then do the following steps. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, then do the following steps. Press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. 
If you are using iPhone 6s plus and earlier models, then do the following steps. Press and hold the home button and sleep or wake button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.